Today I'm going to do an unboxing of a really cool box that was a really cool deal and I couldn't resist. I have been such a good girl lately. I really have. But this time I had to bend. I really did. And we are going to talk about the Glamlight Foodie Box. This goes for $49. I think with tax and shipping and you can use a code. It's called Glamlight15 for 15% 15 off and I did that. And so um, I basically didn't pay any shipping after that. And I'm going to show you what it comes with. But first, I have to do some honorable mentions because I got a, a card from Barbara's Beauty Bag. And um, in the Christmas card, there were these stickers from my, hello, my beauties and cuties. And then I got one because me, her, um, Alice Lynn Love Being a Grammy, and Becca's Beauty Journey, we have our own little chat room where we vent and talk about our ideas and this and that. And we call ourselves the Golden Girls. And I am Blanche. And there's my sticker. I don't know where to put them yet because I want to use them very wisely. So I am going to wait until I find a good spot to put them. Um, I also want to show the giveaway I won from Becca's Beauty Journey. She did a little Jeffree Star giveaway and I won and I was like so shook. Um, and so I'm going to show you what she gave me. The lipsticks were, um, and my eyes are horrible. I think this one is called Crystal Glaze or Copper Glaze or something. It's like it's copper color. Nikki Tutorial Scalper. Um, that's this one. This one doesn't have a smell to it. And then I've got this one. This is um, Control Freak. I think this is really, really cool. And this one smells though. This one has the, that little bit of vanilla smell that, that Jeffrey had to start. But these were, so these were the giveaway things. But, you know, she's my girl. And I don't know if that's the reason why. Or if it's just because she's very giving and kind-hearted. Probably a mix of both. But she sent me along with that. The Jeffree Star X Morphe brush, and it's a detail brush, which I use these like a muffa. And then she gave me the Jeffree Star X Morphe Beauty Sponge Trio, and I can always use beauty sponges. Okay, and here's another thing she gave me. She gave me the Velour Lip Scrub in Watermelon. And last night, when I got it and opened it, I smelled it, and I know you can eat these, right? So, I just went like this. Bitch, this shit tastes good. So I have to like, um, I have to control myself because I probably eat the whole shit. So, but I wanted to mention this. Thank you, Becca, for being so sweet to me. She's always so sweet to me. And so we put those away because I don't want to use them quite yet. I'm going to leave them sitting there in their package. I'll probably post a picture to Instagram. But here now with the foodie box. Okay, I did open it. Um, I'm going to show you the first thing I got. They put a little treat in there. I thought it was so, so cute. This is the Glam Light Cookies and Milk. So I think they're little cookies to eat because it has like the calorie facts and everything on it. And that just is sweet. I don't know any brand that does that. Except for Lily Posh. She'll put peppermints and stuff in your, in your bag. So then it came with, oh, this is so cool. Tis the season. The Glam Light Candy Trio Brush Set. I'm, that's really cool. Um, then it came with the Pecan Pie. It's kind of, the packaging wasn't stable. And it's because of the glue right here. Because once that opens, because two of these were kind of like open. And the Pecan Pie. And I don't. This one smells good, and it has a, a very nice little pink. You see that? But it's a gloss, so it's going to shine. So I like that. I like that a lot. And then it came with the Red Velvet Lipstick. And I love reds, y'all. And if it's a velvet lipstick, it's one of those. Course. Oh, check this out. This comes with. 
the mirror. This one smells absolutely like cake. So check it out. Boom. So I love red velvet lips. I don't wear them often, but I love them. I'm always on this hunt for the perfect lip, especially because of my older skin. Oh, it comes with a card. Dear Foodie, on behalf of Glam White family, we want to wish you sweet Merry Christmas ever. Get into the holiday spirits with all of your favorite festive treats. With love, Giselle and T. So Giselle is the CEO. And she started Glam Light because of body shame and bullying. And so she put, and she's a makeup artist, so she makes makeup and food together. And that's why it's always got food, food things in it. So the last thing I uh, one is the eggnog. This is the eggnog. Ah. It's also not very stable, the packaging. But who cares, because this is just absolutely cool. And I don't remember if this one. This one smells just a tad and it's got this pinky color like this and that's really pretty too it's this reminds me a little bit of the gloss um it reminds me of the rich lux i love you so much just as a gloss so then it came with some eyelashes which are absolutely cool as shit i love them i like how they have a thick band and i'm all for these so the best part of the palette is yet to come, y'all. And that is the pie palette. Ooh. So I did open this stuff earlier just to save a little time because they do package their stuff very, very well. So it has like a red glittery, kind of like an apple, uh, like a, I don't know, like a cherry pie. And these are the shades. Now let me take this off because that's what I didn't do. I normally do. I like this blush. I will be putting that on along with making a look, but I will do that off camera. So I'm going to swatch these for you. We're going to go with apple pie, nutty pecan, and blueberry. Look at those, y'all. Tracy made fun of me. He's like, it's almost like you're creaming when you get new makeup. Okay, so let me get... Where's my makeup eraser, man? There she is. No, she's not. Oh, my God. Well, I'm just going to do it like this. Okay, let me just rub it off on my pants. Okay, so then there's... Uh, those are sh shimmers, and there's mud pie, pumpkin, and mixed berry. Those are matte. So mud pie, pumpkin, mixed berry. Oh, check that pigment out. You can absolutely not bitch about these. So, then there's two more shimmers and one more matte. And that is blackberry peach and sweet potato. Blackberry peach. The peach looks like a copper, honestly. And sweet, sweet tater. Let's go with those. I seriously cannot complain like really and i will show you a look on that and um i'm gonna go ahead and do an eye look i'm not sure what but when i come back i'll show it to you mm, just coming in here uh the first color i used is mud pie i don't know how it looks for you but in my house with my lights it kind of there's something about browns lately on my eyes they tend to look they have like a red tone to them I uh, don't know if I'm just a little batshit crazy or what, but yeah, that's it. It kind of gets like a pinkish red underneath it. I don't know. I did this on another palette and it looked like that too. So this is kind of like where I'm getting at so far. I'll hit you back up in just a second. Okay, so here we are with the final look. I'm going to show you guys which ones I used. I used Mud Pie on my outer corner and I stamped it at the bottom and then I used uh, pumpkin on the bottom and then I used sweet potato here towards the inside and then for the cut crease I used the blueberry and the apple pie um, which <laughs> I love their shimmers um, and the cherry blush I have the cherry blush on I like it it's kind of pinky 
but it is very pigmented. Be careful when you want to put on this kind of blush. <clears throat> and for the lips, I have decided to go with the pecan. Oh, that feels good, and it, and I love an uncomplicated color. Mmm, yeah, this is good. And it's sweet, too. It doesn't taste like nothing, but you kind of can taste and smell it, I guess. It makes no sense. But anyways, that's the review on the Glam Light palette. Uh, the pie palette and the foodie box. Uh, this all together, the brushes work pretty good. I didn't, I, I didn't use, I used this one to lay it down, that one to smoke it out, and this one for my cut crease, um, just to lay the shimmers down. It didn't show up, and that never works for me that they show up absolutely great with just a brush. It depends. I've got some that do work, but to me, it just doesn't pick up enough. Maybe it's meant for something else. I don't know, but I also used it for my water, uh, from under my eye. I'm not wearing a liner or anything specific lately because I have problems with my eyes and I have to wait until they like totally heal. Okay. So anyways, all of this and the lashes for $49 when the original price is like 150. So I think that's a really good deal, especially if you're a Glam Light fan. Um, a lot of people think this is tacky and cheesy, but I love the themes. They always come out with some cool shit. I've never been disappointed by any of their palettes um, or anything about their formula. They are absolutely great and they blend very good. So, you know, the quality, if you're like looking for upper quality, there you go right here. And, um, and they're, they're like all around really good packaging, everything. And their customer service is absolutely awesome. So anyways, that's it for today. Thanks for watching my video, and I'll see y'all in the oh next God, one. You guys, don't laugh. I know it's a freaking dodo. So the cookies and cream thing that I thought was cookies, well, I came in here wanting to eat them, and I packed it out, and it's a highlighter. It's a highlighter. So you get a highlighter, three lipsticks, three brushes, lashes, and a palette for $50. That's kind of cool. It's like a... It's a weird color. It's like mixed from silver and gold. Kind of like, it's cool. So anyways, just wanted to update you on that. I'm such a dodo. Anyways, let me see.